Welcome to the J.R. Hendrick Texan Night, a podcast that deals with the early life of yours truly. And now, narrating the story, Jimmy. 3.30 a.m. Jerry wakes up early and is sitting in his living room enjoying the wee hours of the morning. His father, Jim, had arranged for the butler to stay overnight at the ranch. The butler's name was Eldon, and seeing J.R. awake, he decides to give him a businessman's haircut. Five fifteen a.m. J.R. is in the ma- the ranch living room talking to Grandma Elizabeth. He realizes that this is his last full day in Texas until August 18th. He's ready to go on this internship and enjoy life in Washington, D.C. Nine thirty a.m. Bill picks up J.R. to go to University Heights Baptist Church one last time. J.R. was ready for some good Southern country preaching. Eleven a.m. In church at University Heights Baptist, Pastor Frank Lasser delivers a message about faith and salvation. This hits J.R. to the very core. He enjoys the singing of the hymns, the reading of the King James Bible, Sunday church, Sunday school, all of it. 3 p.m. Uncle Carl and Aunt Donna show up at the uh, at the ranch and in the kitchen they took a look at J.R.'s haircut it looks fabulous he's gonna he's gonna nail this internship I think it looks pretty good I might say Carl said you know if Junior here my brother had his way He'd have a flat top. What's wrong with that? I wouldn't mind it myself, Uncle Tom said, but I know that Jim would have a conniption. 5.30 p.m. Dave picks up Jay at the ranch before going to pick up Ken. They head to the gateway building of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints to watch... The important fireside. 6 p.m. At the fireside, J.R. is listening to Elder Jeffrey R. Holland talking about the Holy Ghost and the importance of the Holy Ghost. <coughs> J.R. Is, living, is drinking deeply in the teachings, taking copious notes. 7 p.m. Elder Boyd K. Packer gives a stirring talk about the atonement of Jesus Christ from the Garden of Gethsemane all the way through to the cross. J.R. sat mesmerized, feeling the spirit as he took notes on that talk as well. That combined with some of the singing, being led by local leaders, it left him a feeling like he'd never experienced before. 7.45 p.m. With the fireside open uh, over, J.R., Dave, and Ken, and some of their friends go into the Relief Society room to pray. 8.30 8.30 a.m. The trio, J.R., Ken, and Dave, get ready to drive to Auntie 
uh, Wendy's Homestead, a pancake and dessert house, open 24 hours a day in Midland, Texas. 11.30 p.m. The three exit the restaurant, and before getting into the car, Jared gives some, Ken something that he been wanting to give him. And that was the idea of the full armor of God. J.R. would use this throughout this, his summer internship to deal with his father and other aggravating factors. Ken gives J.R. a hug for one last time as Dave and the, and the three get into the car and drive off to the ranch. This was to be Jarrah's last night in the in the Texas area. Hope you enjoyed listening to Jarrah Henry Texan concert. If you like what you hear, please subscribe, become a part of the adventure. It's Jimmy Hendrix saying until next time, get ready for the rest of his story. The internship is coming up.